Hey everyone, it's Andy Petronic here from the Whole Life Challenge, and I'm here today to show you a thoracic spine mobilization. What the heck does that mean? Many of us, because we work at desks and we work at computers, are fixed in a very a spine forward position, like this, at an extreme. And um, our joints in our thoracic spine have become very good at leaning forward rather than being in the position that they naturally were when you were born. So reversing that is a very good thing. Now it's important that you're gentle with your spine because if you haven't bent your vertebrae backwards in a while, uh, it could hurt. So go slowly, go gentle, no pain cave. You're going to need a tool in this stretch. It's called a foam roller. This is a six inch foam roller. They have three inch foam rollers. You can even roll up a towel. Some of you will feel that uh, to get started. Um, but once you got it, uh, I've, I've, I've actually seen people use barbells for this stretch. So you can use whatever feels supportive and right for your spine. So you're gonna put that in your, right in about the spot of your uh, lowest rib, not down in your lumbar spine. Straighten out your legs and then lay back. Once you're in that position, fantastic. If it feels good, take your arms back behind you. You're gonna hold that position for about 10 to 15 seconds, and once you have, you're gonna curl back up, lift your butt, and roll forward. So this, the full roller actually is rolling up your spine. And do it again. Come back up after 10 or 15 seconds, do it again. You're gonna work your way up your spine until you get up to a place where you don't feel it anymore, up near your neck. And then you're gonna go back down to the bottom and do it again. Again, your goal is to spend five, uh, 10 minutes moving through these positions in your spine. If you don't have a foam roller and need an alternative, a great one to do is lining yourself up on the floor with your thighs perpendicular to the floor, reach your arms way out in front of you, and drop your chest and your armpits down toward the floor, almost like you're trying to kiss the floor or bring your armpits down into the floor. Again, it's very important on these stretches that you're going to the point of um, slight discomfort, not overdoing it, and accumulating 10 minutes. There you have it. See you soon.